you've spoken about being adopted and how that's influenced your view of, of family life. Um, and you've also been to a couple marches for life. I was mm -hmm. wondering, um, it seems likely that Roe v. Wade is going to be overturned. What do you think the yeah. political impacts of that are going to be? Never, ever try to second guess the Supreme Court. But, I mean, sitting right next to us, I mean, the greatest gift I've ever had in my life. Um, you know, my, my wife and I spent years and years and years trying to adopt. Um, and she's third generation adopted. So I was born in an unwed mother's home uh, back when they used to have those. Um, my brother, my sister, uh, my father was too. Um, and now I, my wife and I, we're both 59 and we have a six year old. So you know we're pathologically optimistic. It is the most fun I've ever had in my life. And I have a photo, I think, over there that actually has my sister and her birth family and my brother and a little bit of his birth family and myself and my birth family, we all went to Disneyland. And, and, and it's this big crowd. And you start to realize the definition of what is family is very different today than it was three decades ago. Um, I mean, you know, if you take a look at the family photo, there's all sorts of different races and, and you know, different groups and this and that, and, and, and still it's all love. And what I'm hoping is, is, is the whole discussion of what is family? What is life? What is government's place in this? That those of us who are pro-life are approaching it from a hopeful, optimistic standpoint that maybe the biases, the prejudices of, of past decades are gone. And now it's the love of life and understanding sometimes life is, is brutal, it's tough. And we all struggle like crazy to have it. So uh, we'll see. Um, it, 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 it will have some interesting ramifications at state levels and community levels and um, but we'll see. Uh, I, I've been shocked how kind people, even people who were not where I am ideologically on the subject, you know, also being from a conservative Catholic family, um, but they've been always very kind to me because I think they understand how personal it is.